I am Aurora Jimenez, and I am a visual development artist here at Sony Pictures Animation. I grew up in Madrid, Spain. My parents were very supportive. My mother, she wrote poetry and she used to draw. And my father, he's a comic collector, so he was giving me all his comics growing up. My parents had a bookshop, and they sold all kinds of books and comics and art supplies. My sister and I, after school, we had to kill time until they closed the shop. So we just draw <laughs> and read and paint. All the awesome stories I read, I was visualizing every character, even designing extended stories for those characters, so I had a, a lot of fun. When we were on family holidays, we had to drive from Madrid to Cadiz in the south of Spain, and that is 400 miles. So my father came up with the stories while driving the 400 miles. It was something very interactive. He let us help him telling the story, so that was a lot of fun, actually. I think that the fact that we could contribute to the stories, that helped me a lot for later on coming up with my own characters and my own worlds. I wanted to be an artist, so I went to study fine arts. One of the subjects at the university was video art and computer animation, and I loved that class. And I was like, wow, this is amazing. I want to do that. I want to work in, in animation. After I got my degree in fine arts, I still wanted to do something related with animation. But the thing is, in Spain, there was no school for that. So I thought, OK, I can apply my knowledge in drawing and painting to film school. So I went to get my degree in art direction for film. I learned how to tell stories visually. In the long run, that's helped me a lot, because I could apply directly what I learned in the film school to animation. After graduating, I work in an animation company that was doing TV animated series. That was great because the art director mentored me and he was teaching me how animation works, what is the pipeline, what is the process, so I could shadow him and learn all of that. I met my husband, Carlos, on my last year at the film school. And he's an artist too. He was studying uh, art direction too. So since then we've been together. The thing of dating another artist is that the whole life becomes artistic. We are challenging each other all the time and learning from each other all the time. I wanted to work on more movies and in, at that time in Spain there wasn't very many animation companies so I decided to try abroad. So we moved to London and we ended up working in the same movie together, The Tale of Despero. One thing an artist has to be is open to explore, and traveling helps you to do that. When we finally moved to the US, my first job was in electronic arts, actually designing characters and environment for some of their games. And that was a great time, and I got to learn something new. By that time, I had worked in so many different platforms, like movies, commercials, TV series, and now video games. And I really love to learn how to apply my knowledge. I learned that Kelly Asbury was making a movie here at Sony Pictures Animation, so because I really like his work, I decided to apply to Sony and try to work with him. So I came for the interview, and Michael Kurinska, production designer, saw my work and he loved it. So he offered me another job in a different movie, Hotel Transylvania 2, and he told me, you know, Gendy is the director. I was like, oh no, really? <laughs> I love his work. So it's what I did for a year, working with them in Hotel Transylvania. Hotel Transylvania 2 has lots of new environments. The first assignment I had is designing the monster camp. So I had to design from the big valley with the mountains, the forest, the lake, to the really, really small things the characters are using in the scene. Also, we have other environments, more human environments, and it was very fun to, to design for humans versus monsters, because we had to come up with different shape language and different ideas for them. After working at Hotel Transylvania 2 for one year and a half, I got the chance to work in the new Smurfs movie with Kelly Asbury. This movie is an all animated movie, and it's more close to the comic books from Peyo that I used to read when I was a kid, so it's quite exciting. I'm designing the, the worlds where the Smurfs are. It reminds me of my childhood when I used to play with the little figurines of the Smurfs. It's really great. I love the shape language. I love the style. It's cute and charming. What I like of working at Sony Pictures Animation is that I never got to work in the past with so many women artists. Here at Sony, you have from the head of the studio 
directors, production designers, visual development artists, even storyboard artists. It's really great to be surrounded by these talented women, learning from them and making friends with them. Sony Pictures Animation is a fairly small studio, so you get to know everybody. You get to work with artists who you admire, but you can call your friends because you have the opportunity to meet them every day, work with them and, and learn from them. So I'm pretty happy to be spending my whole day in that world.